Right, good morning and welcome back to another vlog here on Coaster Crazy. Yes, it's another random video. We're still in Cumbria, but we're sort of North Cumbria now, heading back towards the M6. And yeah, I was recommended to come here by my dad because he actually built this 20 odd years ago. Well, well, we all know, yeah, 21 years ago. This place actually opened in the year 2000. I don't actually know what's in it at all. I know there's some shops and an IMAX cinema, but other than that, I don't know what it is. It's actually a service station. So when you're driving from the top, we drove past here yesterday and I thought, oh, it's just a petrol station, but it's not. You drive sort of round the back, the petrol station's up at the top and then you sort of drive down into here and park up for free, I'm guessing. I haven't seen any signs for parking, but it's an old quarry. And what they've done is they've built this man-made hill. You can see all like the grass and stuff it's all fake it's a facade so we'll go in here it's called reg re re reged i don't know how you pronounce it but it's all like um based on like vikings and things it's all quite mythology i can't, I can't mythological. speak mythological yeah i can't speak today <laughs> so yeah if you've seen the last vlog where we is um covered some of the other attractions here in cumbria i wasn't sure if this was got a warrant of vlog or not but I'm guessing it, it is, you know, because I think it's quite big and there's quite a few things in here. It's like a gallery and what well, it says on the sign here. Yeah. And I'll put my face mask on as well. I know we don't really need them on now, but it's just for other people's health and safety, I suppose, isn't it? But yeah, this is, this is where we are. This is, the, this is the name of the place. Well, yeah, it's all to do with like Vikings and things like that. I think it's to do with like the actual area of parts of Cumbria. Oh God, I can't, hang on, hang on a minute. <laughs> Try and get my mask on. Leave my glasses off. But yeah, this is really smart. My dad said there's a picture of him driving his tower crane because he does what I do, drive, operate tower cranes for a living. So I'll get, I'll get some pictures when I come out. But so, I don't really know what's in here. Uh, there's toilets just here. Um, looks all right. I mean, there you go. You can see how it's how it's built up. There's an outdoor shot. I don't think we'll be in here long. It's probably a 20-minute video. Pop-up shop for the senses. There's a lift there. Oh yeah, I can smell that. Oh, it smells very good. My mask's just fallen off my face. Yeah, there is people in here wearing face coverings. It just doesn't uh, sound great. It's all muffled. There's an art gallery up here. Uh, meeting rooms, indoor play. There's a cinema and a cafe and shop. There's a deli in here. Can't see any pictures yet. It's what my dad's crane. I might have to ask someone. But we won't be in here long because we're actually off sort of towards Morecambe to go and meet up with um, Martin and Charlotte. There's an outdoor area out there. There's the cinemas over there. This is really smart in here. <laughs> I knew nothing about this place. Yeah, it's basically like a glorified service station. Uh, there's a shop down in here. So if you're in the sort of just, um, just between Keswick and Penrith, really oh wow beautiful outside There's some shops up here i think you want to see inside the shops it's like a shopping center it's weird clothing and well-being that's very nice and there's more shops and things around there oh wow follow it up around this way some more shops up here oh there's the art gallery over there there's a toy shop oh it's very nice <laughs> it's lovely in here and it's all sort of built in this man-made hill so yeah I'll look to Wikipedia there's pretty much no information about this place at all but if you go into the uh, history of um of raghead then it's like it's all sort of to do with yeah it's to do with like the vikings and 
things like that. So it's an actual place. There's like a meeting point just here behind me. There's your lift that came up from where I was at the sense room. It's like offices. Oh, it's really smart in here though. This is really cool. I've got a few pictures as well while I'm in here. There's tickets there, I don't know what tickets are for. I don't even know if you're allowed to film in it, <laughs> if I'm honest. There's a gallery there. Yeah, what are the tickets for? Is that for the cinema? That must be for the cinema. There's a gallery here. Gallery and design shop. Looking through through the through the locking glass not the looking glass the locking glass I don't know if I'm allowed to film in here you know go and have a look oh that's nice candles and smells different cards and stuff over there all these different pens and earrings or dark crafts some pottery I think the gallery's through there I don't really know what I said, I don't really know what I'm supposed to be filming in here. <laughs> Never mind. All sorts of books and stuff like that. Some art. Uh, utensils, pens, papers. Here, here's where we were yesterday, Derwent. Uh, pencil Museum. So yeah, very famous pencils. I don't know if it's anything on these. Uh, Dirt went drawing. So if you haven't seen that vlog from yesterday, go and check it out. We went to the Derwent Pencil Museum, and we went to Raven Glass Railway, and I showed you around the hotel that we stayed in as well last night. It was uh, very nice, but yeah, I don't know if I can film in the gallery, so I'll turn you off for now. I don't know what's that way. Indoor play, meeting rooms. Just go and have a look to see what this is. Have you booked your ticket? Yeah, I think you need to pay for something. I don't really, I don't really know. Indoor play, making space. Oh, there's another cafeteria in here. There's toilets over there. Oh yeah, this is like a kids play area. Right, so I've just come out of the uh, the gallery there. Yeah, you weren't actually allowed to uh, to film in there. So I did film some stuff, but I ain't got to put it in this video at all so to respect that she did come up to me said i wasn't too sure that if you were allowed to film or not maybe come back another day i said no it's just a it's just a flying visit i'm just putting in a bit of footage to show people what's here if they were interested in coming and have a little look maybe going to cumbria themselves and wanting to stop by and see what this is place is like um so yeah art galleries are normally quite a big no-no for for filming and even taking pictures but it was nice, there was some nice artwork in there, all inspired by the uh, coronavirus and the lockdown of uh, 2020 and what some artists were doing in the lockdown. Some really nice pictures, some were very expensive, and paintings and things as well. So just walking past these shops again, and then we've got to go down back down to the foyer, have a look at the gift shop, and then we're going to go um, back towards Morecambe now, I think. Like I said, um, I was in the art gallery. Uh, I was supposed to be going to see me mum. I haven't seen her for for quite a while. Um, I did phone up the other day to see if it was all well, to tell her that we were coming. She doesn't want to see me. She's actually quite ill, um, and she's been isolated in her own home for quite a while. Even though I'm double jabbed and stuff, she just doesn't want me to go around and see her. So we'll go again later in the year, whenever we can, to go and see her. But. They've still got the Taylor's Fun Fair there. I don't think I'll do another vlog. 
the booster max is now open and there's a coaster there which I don't think I've been on so uh, she's in the shop down here but that's basically it this is the place I don't think there's a picture of my dad's crane in here so I just talked to the lady upstairs and she said a lot of the foyer and a lot of this is has been done up recently but you've got the cafeteria there we don't really need anything might probably go to the toilet before we set off I'll just go just go and have a look down here to show you what's here uh, down this section here it's just an outdoor bit but it's really pretty it's really modern and really nice inside but yeah it's just like a I don't know what it is like a pond it's really smart the cinema's down there but again you've got to pay for the films I don't think there's anything else on I think there's like normal films which are out now at the moment I haven't seen the science is showing you what what films are on food drink and kitchenware so it's really nice what's here I just um I don't know <laughs> it's not, not really my sort of thing um but yeah it's nice it's a nice place if you're stopping off in Cumbria to come and have a look in here it doesn't cost you anything it's free free parking and stuff seen anything <laughs> This whole kitchen wire and yeah. Oh, there's not much in here really. Homemade stuff, oh, there's like honeycomb, hand cut comb, comb even, honeycomb, not comb. <laughs> That's someone else that says that, your wines and your spirits and things. Yeah. <laughs> One thing my parents would always use to say for coming in there, don't touch anything. But that's it, I'll probably go outside now and just wrap it up really. Like I said, a very short video showing you what's here at Ragged if you wanted to come and visit it yourself. Right, so that's it. <laughs> I'm back outside. Yeah, I mean, it's impressive what they've done. They've built like a shops and a restaurant and a cafe and that sort of thing in there. But yeah, there's not really much in there. If I'm honest, my dad said, oh yeah, there's loads of things to do. But it's nice to come and have a look. Just picked up this leaflet here, actually telling you what's on at the cinema. So there's uh, Jungle Cruise, which is the new Disney movie. Uh, Space Jam, um, The Crudes, Peter Rabbit 2, uh, Old, Wolf Walkers, Another Road and Supernova. So I actually thought there was like um, films to do with like the area and things, but no, it's just actual films. But yeah, there you go, that's uh, Regged. Um, very short vlog, not much in it, but it shows you what's here. But uh, yeah, don't forget to comment, like and subscribe. Uh, check out the Facebook page and the Instagram account. Coast of Crazy Andy for more pictures and um, yeah, I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.